you have any fours? Give me your creams. Go fish. Uh, why were your clothes all wet yesterday? I went swimming. Mummy, yes. A TK. So? Who do you want to kiss him? Stop it. He's just my friend. But you still want to kiss him? Cut it out, Harmony. The first person you kiss, you never forget. So it's important. You never forget forever? Forever. Now go fish. again. It's pretty selfless what he did. You still like him after all of that? The heart wants what it wants, Harm. <laughs> I guess so. But it never stops. City of angels, but no Are you so smiley? I'm not smiley. Please, well, at least tell me one of us is having luck in the romance department. Have you still not told Harmony how you feel? Well, she caught me almost kissing Katie, then I broke up with Katie, and now I'm supposed to kiss Harmony, but on stage. Leo's still MIA, I take it? Yep, and his timing could not be worse. Or better, considering now you have the chance to kiss Harmony. Layla! <sighs> Come on. So today will be my last meeting at the Appeal. I've been working this paper since I was younger than most of you here, and it's meant everything to me. Kit's gonna take over the senior edition, and I wanted to welcome our new junior editor, Margot. <laughs> and Layla, you'll be our new junior managing editor. I know I'm leaving the appeal in great hands, but it's going to be up to you two to work together. Don't let me down. I guess this means we'll be seeing a lot of each other next year. Yeah, I guess so. You know, I'm glad it didn't work out between us as friends. Would have made it awkward for you to work for me. Don't you mean work with you? We'll see. I know the math team voted for me. At least I hope they did. Who do you think the twins voted for? The Adams twins? No, no, the Shea twins. They're twins. They don't look like twins. Let's hope they vote alike for me. Attention, Attaway Middle Schoolers. This is Ellie Mack here with your election results. The votes have been tallied. That was fast. Too fast, right? Wow, I guess this is the big moment. Eggie will either rise to the top of the hierarchy or fall from grace. This moment will influence his place in the middle school history books for years to come. Sorry. I was just adding to the drama of the moment, spicing it up a little. You've been watching telenovelas again, haven't you? Every night, I just can't resist. The romance, the intrigue, the drama. Can you quiet down a little? Sorry. I guess this is it. It'll be okay. No matter what happens, can we talk later? Yeah, we need to talk. And the next student body president of Attaway Middle School is... Honestly, didn't see that one coming. Well, I guess things really are gonna start changing around here. Sorry, Aggie. <laughs> hey, Claire. Hi, Gus. I know you probably don't want to hear it from me, but I just want to say congratulations. You deserve it. Wait. I... 
couldn't have won without you. I'm sorry I said what I said. It was super dumb of me. I know better than anyone. It's hard to control who you like. Still, you trusted me. And I still trust you. Friends? Friends. See you with the play? Wouldn't miss it. If we offend, it is with our good will that you should think we come not to offend, but with good will. That you should here repent you. These actors are at hand, and by their show, you shall know all that you are like to know. Almost show time. Walker, that prologue was perfect. Now, let's all get ready for the top of act one. This is it, you guys. You all right? I don't know if I told you this, but I have major stage fright. But you were so good on that violin. It's different. I just get so nervous without it. The lights are so bright. You can't even see the audience. You're going to be a great Lysander. You know I broke up with Katie. I hope it wasn't because of our stage cast. Not exactly. Remember those flowers at the dance competition? Come on, Harmony. Walker, you're up. What? Already? Come on, we're on. I... I can't do this. Walker, what are we gonna do? We need a Lysander. And a Lysander you shall have. Ready? How now, my love? Why is your cheek so pale? Oh, hell, to choose loves by another's eyes. The course of true love never did truly run smooth. If thou lovest me, steal forth thy father's house tomorrow night. And in the wood, a league without a town, there I will stay for thee. In the same place thou hast appointed me, tomorrow truly will I meet with thee. I frown upon him, yet he loves me still. Oh, that your frowns would teach my smile such skill. I give him curses, yet he gives me love. Oh, that my prayers could such affection move. The more I hate, the more he follows me. The more I love, the more he hateth me. Rest us, Hermia. And if you think it good, then tarry for the comfort of the day. Be it so, Lysander, find you in a bed. For upon this bank I rest my head. One pillow will serve for us both. One heart, one bed, two bosoms, and one troth. Nay, Lysander, for my sake, my dear, lie further off yet, do not lie so near. Oh, take the sense, sweet of my innocence. Love takes one's meaning in one's conference. You did great. Why do you look so sad? You didn't lose an election. That's about the only thing we didn't lose. Do you mean a friend? As far as I know. Look, we've been friends since we were kids. And we have the whole summer ahead of us. So why don't we just forget about all this election stuff and become friends again? Really? I'm in. Are we too old for a group hug? Never. Hey, new kid, get in here too. Me? Yeah, you're one of us now. We're basically like the chicken boys at this point. I can't believe we pulled it off. The sets looked so good, Belle. And so was the dancing. Everyone's talking about the play and completely forgotten about my election victory. I'm sure you'll remind us plenty. Well, at least one of us got a kiss. When Leo kissed her, I held my breath for like 10 minutes. Even if I was super jealous, it was so romantic. 
So does this mean you're not running away? <laughs> it means my dad caught me at the bus stop. I know you really wanted to go, but we need you tonight. You saved the play. I shouldn't have left. We worked too hard for that. Is it any better with your dad? It's complicated with us. We just never were meant to get along. But the summer, you'll try, right? Harmony, I'm still leaving. My dad called my grandparents and they said I could stay with them. I'm gonna miss that away and I'm gonna miss you, but I have to go. Tonight, on stage, does that count as my first guess? I'm counting it as mine. Then I guess I'll remember you forever. Goodbye, Lou McCoy. I got some chicken girls waiting on me. I just had this revelation on stage where I wanted to be a better guy. That's why I made up with Gus. That's great, Eggie. But I just realized that the one person that stayed with me throughout this whole entire time was you. Peggy. Let me just finish. That's it. I have to say something. Say what? Simone, she's cheating on him. What? How do you know about that? I can't say, but I know she is. I'm going to tell him. Wait, you can't. Why not? Because the person someone's cheating with is me. I want to start fresh with you. We don't have to be cool. We can just be together. Okay, sure. Let's dance. I'm getting the feeling that I'm not the only one who had a weird night. Come on, let's just go. I agree, I'm out. You guys, come on. Look on the bright side. Claire, you're our new president. Layla, you're managing editor. And Harm, you just star in the school play. And it's about to be summer. Bell's right. I mean, not everything went our way, but we still got each other. And we're still the chicken girls. And we're the best dancers here. <laughs> Next week on Chicken Girls. Ready to go? Harmony, I am so sorry, but Kayla is throwing a party and this is the only time we'll see each other this summer. Yeah, but you're my sister. Right, easy to take for granted. Eggie, what are you doing? Simone, will you be my long distance steady girlfriend? Drama! That was private. I'm just walking down the street minding my own business.